I am them and you are me. You know what I mean? I am who I serve. I've done it. I've been there. I've seen it. Tomas Martinez spent several years in and out of prison. Now, he uses his life experience to help young men of color walk a different path. When I was 12 years old, I put the needle in my arm. By the time I was 13, I was a full-blooded heroin addict. When I got arrested in 1976, I had 22 counts of armed robbery. I was facing life in prison. They convicted me of one, and I landed up getting, getting 15 to 55 years for that. It was a crazy world in there. It was violent. I seen people burnt alive. I seen people mutilated. I seen enough death to last me a lifetime. I used to run a group back in prison when I was incarcerated. I told the guys, I said, how are we going to scare these kids straight? Come on, we got to educate them. You got to tell them what prison life's all about, man, that it's a world of its own and it's a violent world. I felt that that was my calling. I mean, that that's where I was supposed to be, trying to help youth uh, learn that, you know what, there's a better life. Martinez works at La Placita. La Placita is an institute that helps young men transition into life after prison. I'm also a promotor, a navigator. Uh, I navigate the system for people that are coming out of uh, incarceration. When they leave, you know, after 10, 12, 15, even two years, even one, they give them $50 and they tell them, go make it the best way you can. Yeah. So they come at a loss from the gate. And that's why I love what I do today. I mean, because I don't want to see them go through what I went through. Martinez has worked at La Placita for eight years. He leads a group called Team Mac, Teens Making a Change. I always tell them, don't be a, don't be a soldier, be a warrior. I mean, don't die for your people, live for your people. Above all, Martinez is glad his mother has seen his work in the community. He turned around a lot and is doing very good. I'm proud of him. I'm really proud of him because he's uh, helping kids now and proud that, you know, he doesn't give me no trouble. That's what's good. I did my gang banging, I did my drug dealing, I did my drug using right here in this barrio, in the Sudeño Valle, and now I do my positive work here.